Viking Academy, the greatest gym on this side of Pluto. Listen, we've done amazing things in this gym. We produced roughly a thousand champions from Japan to Oklahoma to Spain, and I'm Professor Stephen Williams. Now, today, what we're working on is a cradle series. And my special guest for today, none other than London's own Frankie. How does that sound? The Cradle series, I mean. This is spectacular. I'm so excited to do this right now. Are you ready for this? We're working right from the turtle position and we're attacking the cradle. Listen, listen to what I'm about to tell you. By the way, one second, before, before we even attack the situation of life, we got Rich shooting the BDS. Rich, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, girl, girl, girl. Rich is responsible for bringing La Chapta to the, to America. That's how I it. The all fours. Now listen, I'm in a position where we're, we'll call this turtle position, right? And I'm looking to cradle my partner. Now jujitsu people, jujitsu players, they typically don't post that leg. They stay in the sedentary knee position with the knees and the elbows on the ground. So what I'm gonna do with my right hand is I'm gonna grab around the chest, sort of the armpit area, just like so. Now what I'm gonna start to do is I'm gonna propel my body to the far side. So watch my hips. I start to walk my body to the far side, right? Hips heavy. And I anchor my, my left arm, you see my left arm, all the way around the knee. So I want to get my, my left arm hooked deep around the knee. So if you were to take a snapshot of my arms, my right arm is anchored on Frankie's shoulder, neck area, and my left hand is anchored right below the knee, okay? So from here, all I'm going to do is interlock my fingers. Now we can go from an S grip to a butterfly grip. And all I have to do to topple Frankie over to get it to the side control position is fall towards my left side. So watch this. As I fall, nothing's stopping me from taking her all the way over the top to side control. Now I want to stress this while I'm here is oftentimes when we, especially non-wrestlers, when you get to this position, you come up on top, they're just going to go turtle. So what you have to do is start to run their shoulder blades to the back. Just a little bit. Once I get here, I can go to my knees and start mounting my offense from this position. So let's take a look at it again. I have Frankie in the turtle position. So right over here, and I'm looking to attack. Now, again, most wrestlers are gonna post this leg up to build, right? So if you go to your foot, yep. Yeah. And it'll be any variance. It'll be this angle, it'll be a little longer, maybe this way. But a jiu-jitsu person's rarely gonna do that. They're gonna defend the hooks. They don't want me from the hooks. So I go tight on the pec, I go right around the, the knee, and I start to walk my body around. Okay, so now I'm building for real. Now, now we're talking. I'm not putting my knees on the ground. I'm not putting my knees on the ground. Watch my knees. Right, so I'm here, watch my knees, ready? Here, anchor. Now I'm falling over my left shoulder. And what is my left side? What is the left part of my body doing? It's blocking Frankie's knee so she can't post. My entire body is gonna block her left knee. Oh. And then I pull it over, just like so. Now you know what I've said before in our cradle series that I've demonstrated on YouTube? We can lock the wrist up, we can connect our hands, and we can go to that weird modified sort of uh, chain connection, hammer lock position. Where now, if it's MMA, I can do incredible damage with knees and, and so forth. If I want to take the back, I don't want to say it again, but we can take the hook out, go inside the arm, and start to attack the back from here. Okay, so let's demonstrate that again. Last time, slow-mo. So I have my partner here in the, on the turtle position, I go back position, I start to walk around, I anchor my arms in, I fall to my left side, boom, I push the right over the top, and look where we are, right inside control. Whether I take the chain hammer lock position or not, I can come up on top of the control position. All right, so now we're gonna demonstrate that for you in a relatively fast motion, for, uh, just to show you how it looks in like sort of a realistic situation. So I'm here. Kidding me or what? Thank you, Frankie. Incredible job. Now listen, 
We have one of the most important people ever from London today, and I'm, I didn't really want to oversell it because she gets shy because of the fact that she has royal blood. But she's related to multiple kings and queens. I'll leave it at that. We'll delve deeper next time. Listen, subscribe, leave a comment, leave a like. We have the greatest coach ever to do stand-up. His name's Larry Perna. Incredible. Now listen, I got another thing for you. Don't forget who's in the room, third party. You ever hear him? Rich. I was about to give up your last name, okay? My man Rich. Let's see Rich one more time. Subscribe, like the button, and pow! Red and kiss. <laughs>